Hello everyone this is Ranjan Kumar Kalindi and today we are going to talk about BL project engineer and trainee engineer interview process as we know BL is the one of the ninth PSU under Ministry of Defense of India so congratulations for those who got selected for this interview process and let me tell you uh, BL will call in a respective unit uh, where they are recruiting suppose they are recruiting for Bangalore complex then they they will call you for Bangalore unit only and suppose they are recruiting for uh, what Panchkula or Ghaziabad or any other unit then they will call you in Panchkula Ghaziabad and any other unit only okay anyhow in your admit card only uh, the mens uh, the address is mentioned already and uh, time is already mentioned so you can check that one okay so whatever time is there you have to come before that time okay then let's start we'll start some uh, what is the process and all this thing for interview okay the first process is document verification uh, when you will uh, you will arrive here for uh, that uh, interview first they will verify your document okay so whatever uh, document mentioned in your admit card you have to carry all the admit card in original format also and copy format also here like it's mentioned copy of application submitted online so when you form when you fill this form at the time of uh, online applying so that time one uh, at the last only provisional application came so that application form you have to carry on okay and this admit card you have to carry and uh, sslc certificate your 10th mark sheet your 12 mark sheet 12 certificate you have to carry your provisional uh, provisional certificate or degree certificate you have to carry and uh, cgpa and percentage calculation one certificate is there in your college where it's mentioned how that percentage is calculated in your college for cgpa to percentage that you have to carry and suppose you are belong to any caste so you have to carry a caste certificate then uh, work experience uh, yeah, uh, your work experience certificate uh, required then suppose if uh, if you are still working in a company then you need an NOC certificate non objection certificate uh, required with appointment letter and latest pay okay and any photo identity proof issued by a government of India so this document required for this interview and please mind it like if any document any one document will miss then they will not allow for this interview so you have to carry all the document now coming to the interview process so in interview round in interview panel generally three to four member will be there to take your interview and these are uh, uh, and these are manager or general uh, senior manager from uh, different department so what they will ask like uh, I can't give you a correct or uh, what a exact question or uh, related question but I can give a hints like they will start with your in, uh, introduction they will ask about yourself only so you have to give your and uh, give your introduction with a confidence and a smile okay so let me talk about T trainee engineer trainee engineer candidates generally these are either a fracers or five to six month experience they have or they have done any apprenticeship suppose you have done any apprenticeship so they will ask directly question from your apprenticeship in which company you have done apprenticeship what you have done there what you learned and these many questions they will ask and for uh, like a job uh, you if you are doing job still like five to six months you have work experience then they will ask about your work profile what kind of work you have doing what is your role and uh, what you are doing that they will ask about your work experience and for freshers for freshers they will ask generally a final year project what you have done in final year what kind of project you made what component requ uh, component needed for uh, that project these all question they will ask and from that component only they will arise questions and you can expect some technical question from your technical subject okay this is this is about uh, t trainee engineer for p p means project engineer for project engineer uh, they need two year experience so already they will ask question about your work experience only 
so whatever work experience you have they will ask question from that only what kind of a kind of position you are holding what kind of role was there in your company that they will ask okay suppose uh, in it is mentioned here only industrial certificate needed so suppose you have done any production field job so in that how one unit or one device manufactured they will ask from input to output you have to explain each and everything what kind of machine you have used what device you used everything you have to explain and what is your role this is important in this question okay so you have have to explain this all these things and you for two one or two percent you can expect your technical question from your technical background okay and after that they will ask general question like uh, if you got selected then uh, how you be how you will be do this uh, job role whatever position like uh, if i will give uh, you are te or pe then how you will handle this job suppose uh, we will send somewhere in a india for a field work whether you are able to do this job or not so whatever they will ask you have to give your answer in a proper way okay so generally this interview will take you around 15 to 20 minutes to complete this interview process and uh, whatever you will give answer give in a proper way with a confidence and a smile okay so all the best for your interview thank you